Deer mice are small rodents that cause frequent problems for home and business owners in rural areas or even in urban neighborhoods close to parks, forests, or other dense vegetation. These small mice can invade indoor spaces through cracks and crevices and walls and other entry points. When an infestation breaks out indoors, the deer mice are capable of ruining foodstuffs, chewing food and wiring, and spreading diseases like hantavirus. So in this video, we'll show you how to identify deer mice, how to eliminate an infestation, and how to prevent further infestations from breaking out. To shop for the products featured in this video and to learn more about rodent control, click the links in the video's description and get free shipping on your order. The first thing you should do in any pest control plan is identify what exactly you're dealing with. Careless identification can lead to wrong treatment methods, costing you time and money. Deer mice are small rodents commonly found outdoors, but will occasionally invade indoors in search of food, water, and shelter. Their bodies are 2 to 3 inches in length, and their tails add another 2 to 3 inches. When compared to other rodents, deer mice have large ears and large black eyes. The top side of the fur can range from different shades of brown, while the underside is white. Inspection is the next phase of any good pest control plan. Once you know what your pests look like, check around your property to confirm their presence or find activity hotspots. When looking for deer mice, start indoors in the kitchen, bathroom, attic, basement, and garage. Check within cabinets, behind appliances, and behind any storage. You're looking for deer mice activity, which may also include the mice themselves. Look for gnaw marks, chewed openings, fur on the ground, and smear marks along the walls. When inspecting, note any foul odors and look for their droppings. Mouse droppings are about a quarter of an inch in length with pointed ends. After inspecting indoors, check outside for any rodent burrows or trampled down grass. Paths of flattened grass are evidence of where rodents have traveled. Also, note any openings in fences where pests can invade your property. After identifying your pest and inspecting for activity on your property, it's time to start treatment. Before starting any treatment, put on your personal protective equipment or PPE. Wear a face mask and safety glasses to protect yourself from harmful contaminants, and wear gloves to avoid leaving your human scent on any product you will handle. To eliminate a deer mouse infestation, use traps designed to make rodent control easy and effective, like the Solutions Easy Set Snap Traps and Pro Glue Trays. Our Easy Set Snap Traps offer a quick kill for those looking for a pragmatic approach. To set up, bait the trap's pressure plate and simply pull back on the upright bar until the trap locks into place. There are many foods that rodents are attracted to, but it's best to use something sticky, like peanut butter, so the mouse cannot lift the bait away. When set properly, any rodent that activates the trap will be killed instantly. Indoors, set traps in areas where rodent activity has been observed. Outdoors, we recommend you pair this trap with a Solutions tamper-proof bait station. The bait station will safely house the armed trap without posing a danger to any non-target animals. We also recommend you use Pro Glue trays as an additional method of trapping rodents. These traps are pre-baited with a peanut butter scent to lure rodents to its powerful and sticky glue. To set up Pro Glue trays, simply remove the trays from the package, pull the trays apart, and they're ready to place. The glue tray's flat design even allows it to be placed underneath furniture for more discreet trapping. Use both types of traps, not just to cover more ground, but to also get around bait shyness, which can be observed in many rodent species. Most households may need about 12 of each for effective control. Be sure to set traps about 5 to 10 feet away from each other where you've seen rodent activity. Check traps once a day to see if cleanup is necessary. After setting up traps and bait, it may take several weeks to see a noticeable reduction in pest activity. Prevention is essential to keeping pests in check. Even after applying control methods, the best way to stop pest activity is to ensure it can't happen. For the best results, these prevention strategies should be employed before or soon after you set up traps to prevent further deer mice from coming indoors. First, make your property less conducive to rodent activity. Trim away overgrown shrubbery and regularly mow your grass to its proper height to reduce any possible pest harborages. Seal away any pet food or bird seed into airtight plastic containers, as well as any other food in cardboard or paper packaging. Clean and organize your storage spaces by removing items from the floor and placing them onto shelves away from any rodent's reach. Once your property is cleaned, look around the perimeter of your home or property and seal any entry points you may find. 
Deer mice are able to fit through small openings and even chew their way in. Mice can fit through holes as small as a dime. Any tight cracks, crevices, and voids can be sealed with Sealator Pro Expanding Foam or stuffed with Stuff It Copper Mesh. To get these products as well as any traps with free shipping, don't forget to check out the links in the description. Finally, ensure your garage door creates a tight seal when closed all the way. Any spacing will need to be corrected with a door sweep or door threshold. With these professional products and tips from Solutions Pest and Lawn, you can stop deer mice and other rodents from nesting in your home, and we offer fast, free shipping to help you get control quickly. Visit our website to get your products today. If you like this how-to guide, please share. And if you're new to our channel, subscribe for more how-to and product videos, and contact us for more tips, tricks, and DIY pest solutions.